<laughs> going closer to 90 as we head into the middle and end part of the work week and accompanying that will be that air quality advisory still in place tonight that goes all the way through tomorrow for everyone in Iowa. So keep that in mind again if you are particularly sensitive to the particles in the air from the smoke if you have upper respiratory issues. Keep an eye on the air quality here across the state. Smoke forecast looks like this. We still have the moderate smoke in the area as we head through the evening hours tonight. Dense smoke moves in across again. Unfortunately, eastern Iowa getting the brunt of it heading into the day on Wednesday. This is around lunchtime tomorrow. Dense smoke across uh, the eastern half of the state. And then we'll still kind of see that haze linger, I think, through Wednesday and into early hours on Thursday. So we'll be with or at least under the influence of some of that smoke here for the next day or so. As far as what it looks like rainfall wise, satellite and radar picture looks like this. We've got just a few showers across northwest Iowa and then those kind of split to the north and south here fizzling out as they move into central Iowa. So we're dry for the, uh, the time being. I think we could see a few storms develop overnight tonight and into the first part of your day on Wednesday. Wednesday temperatures able to make it into the mid 80s this afternoon. We've got a little bit of a wind out of the east southeast at about 10 miles per hour. We're warming things up not only today, but also tomorrow and beyond mid 80s right now, and that's the case for most of our neighbors here across the Midwest. Temperatures close to 90 tomorrow and Thursday, and then we drop off just a little bit by Friday and Saturday, but the humidity does stick around as we head closer towards the weekend. So we're going to be hot and muggy here through the next couple of days. Rain chances isolated to scattered here as we head into Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. Hour by hour forecast looks like this. I think if you're doing things in the next couple of hours through the evening hours, if you're heading to the Willie Nelson concert, no issues there. After midnight or so, a few showers and storms bubble up across the state. Those linger potentially into the dawn hours or pre dawn hours on your Wednesday, maybe a little bit of break by lunchtime. And then there's again the possibility that another storm or two pops up tomorrow afternoon and evening. But I think there's a better chance for more widespread activity Thursday and Friday afternoon. Again, just regular showers and thunderstorms, maybe a few of those on the stronger side, but overall severe threat here tonight through tomorrow morning on the lower uh, scale of things. Tonight's forecast keeps us warm again, an overnight storm possible. We're back only into the mid 60s. Tomorrow's forecast closer to 90 degrees here by the afternoon. And again, that smoke and haze will linger, especially across the eastern half of the state. A day forecast looks like this storm chances persist Wednesday, Thursday and Friday afternoons. A little bit drier for the weekend, at least as of now, still hot. We'll keep it right back up into the upper 80s and low 90s by the first part of next week.